New Miss Alabama and winner of a $15,000 scholarship, Abby Stockard, Miss Hoover. And we have the brand new Miss Alabama in studio right here with us, Abby Stockard. Abby. Thank you. Congratulations <laughs> on behalf of WBRC. I have to ask you, how does it feel to take home the crown so close to your hometown? I know I am still on cloud nine. I cannot believe that this is real life right now. Watching that video of me getting crowned, I don't even remember it. <laughs> but I woke up this morning. I am so excited. I feel so honored and I am just so grateful that I get to be Miss Alabama. So let me ask you, how does it feel to wear the crown and know that you've got a platform to be able to talk about a lot of things important to you and other Alabamians. Yeah, I'm so honored that I have a platform of influence. I want to use that platform to be a role model, especially to young women. I want to encourage others to get involved in this organization so they can experience the many opportunities that I've been blessed with with this organization. And I'm excited to grow my service initiative, but I'm also excited to continue increasing visibility of the Miss Alabama organization. Right. Now, obviously, there are a bunch of uh, ways to gain scholarship money if you you plan to go to college or continue your education. So uh, why do you compete in pageants like this? Yes, yeah, so I started competing because of the scholarship um, that this organization provides. And we actually calculated it in the car and I have received a total of $40,000 in scholarships from this organization. And I am so, so grateful because it is allowing me to pursue my educational and career objectives. And that is to one day become a pediatric nurse and ethicist. And that is why I want women to get involved so they can have that scholarship money. Now, I, I take it this wasn't your first pageant. So talk yeah. about that process and, and what was the most challenging aspect of it to you? Yeah, I think the most challenging part was I had never competed in pageants growing up. And so my freshman year of college, my mom encouraged me to get involved because she saw that there was scholarship money associated with it. And so I kind of went in on a whim with no preparation and ended up falling in love with this organization and everything that it stood for. And then that was my first year. I did it last year. And then this year was my third year competing for the title. And I believe I have never been more prepared to step into this role. And so I am so, so excited. We can tell. Abby. So uh, first of all, talk a little bit about what you plan on doing moving forward and how can people be able to track you uh, and the service that you want to do? Yes, so I plan on being a brand ambassador for the Miss Alabama organization. Mm -hmm. You can follow me on social media. It's Miss America AL to keep up with all the many things I will be doing. Um, we have a lot of appearances that are already lined up for this year, so you can see what's going on okay. through that. Uh, I use social media and I just plan on doing as many appearances as I can. I want to get to know the Alabama people. I want to be in intentional and I want to use my heart of service to truly touch the lives and the hearts of the people living in the state. Thank you so much, Abby Stockard, Miss Thank Alabama. You. We got more Fox 6 News coming up after this break. <laughs> 